this. What's up, Jane? Something. Oh yeah, stretch it out, stretch it out. Free. So let's talk a little bit about what's new for Garmin in 2023. These items released earlier this year. We've got the Alpha 300i handheld, and for our collars, we have the Alpha TT25. Now, if you're familiar with the TT15X, it's a little bit of a larger profile, so these are gonna be smaller and they're gonna come with smaller antenna options. So let's go ahead and get these unboxed. So right out of the box, you're gonna notice that there are a couple of items that are a little bit different than previous versions, uh, such as your charging cable. You've actually got a USB-C, which is nice. Uh, charging brick is not included, but most people nowadays have a USB charging brick. Like I said, the USB-C. And then that USB-C is gonna plug up to this little adapter. So that's pretty cool. And then lastly, uh, you've got the longer prongs. So if you've got a dog with long hair, ladies, don't be, oh my goodness. Hey, oh shoot, dadgummit Remy. How in the heck? So at a glance, let's just take a look at the collar itself. Of course, this is a smaller profile, smaller than the TT15X. You've also got a smaller antenna. The standard antenna on this one is about seven to eight inches shorter than the TT15X. And you'll also be able to buy additional antennas. I know in previous versions, uh, these were not as modular. So you will be able to come back in and either shorten this antenna or make it longer. And as for my dogs, we are in the uh, 500 to 1,000 yard range, so there's really no need for us to get you know nine miles out of a collar. So I've got the smaller antenna here. Like I said, this is seven to eight inches shorter than the TT15X. And then if you install this one, this is gonna be probably an additional eight inches shorter. So super low profile antenna for those smaller dogs. And if you look at so this system right here is what receives the information uh, from the satellite. You can also shorten up this mechanism here uh, by purchasing an additional accessory uh, from Garmin. So if you've got an even smaller dog, you'll be able to tighten this collar up just a little bit more. As far as software goes, uh, these will be able to connect to Wi-Fi. So within the first 20 minutes of you plugging this unit up to a charger, it will search for Wi-Fi and update automatically. And then one thing that I did not like about the TT15X is the light was located up underneath the box. So if your dog was walking away from you, you could not see the light. So they have since moved the lights to either side of the box. That way you can see your dog at any angle. And then one last function of the lights, they also included different colored LEDs. So you can change the color of the light. There's like four or five different lights, blue, red, orange, and so forth. So you can differentiate your dogs when it's dark. And I'm not gonna talk about the Alpha 300 a whole lot. I haven't spent enough time with it, but I do know that you have messaging capabilities if you don't have a cellular network, which is pretty cool. And again, this is gonna be charged by a USB-C as well. You do have a brick that's included. You've got a brick and cable. Um, so I'm really happy that they went USB-C across the board. So profile on the 200 and 300i are gonna be virtually the same, except you do have that SOS button over here on the side. And I think that the screen is gonna be a little bit brighter. It's gonna be a richer screen. So yeah, that display definitely looks a little bit better than the 200. Now I'm not sure if that's gonna be a difference between the 200 and 200i and the 300 and 300i, but this screen looks and feels better than the 200. And just like our 200, we're gonna to go to the home screen. We're gonna hit the dog list icon, hit add dog, and then pair collar. And then press and hold the button on the collar until it goes into pairing mode. 
the LED turns blue. Oh, it paired up right away. That's what I've loved the most about these Garmin products is they're very intuitive. I mean, that just automatically paired just like that. And then I'm gonna type in, since Nelly is right here, I'm gonna get her set up first. And this is cool too. This is where you choose their beacon color. So for Nelly, I'm gonna choose yellow. Add more. Now I'm gonna add Remy's collar. Again, I'm holding down that button until the LED turns blue. Gives you that little tone. Pair collar, automatically pairs. And her color is going to be, let's do magenta. Click finish. And now we successfully have Nelly and Remy. Remy's collar is still looking for GPS because I just turned it on. There we go. And then if you want to, it does come with an accessory clip that you can attach to the back. That way you can clip it to your jeans, pocket, whatever. I'm not gonna do that right now. And if you are concerned about battery life, Garmin also offers an extended battery pack so you can remove the housing on this collar. Fairly easy, it's got some screws on the back. You can put this new housing on and extend that battery life. And just for comparison, if you look at the TT15X side by side, you can already tell how much longer this antenna is. Like I said, you can purchase that shorter antenna to give you uh, even more of a low profile look. Remy, bless her heart, I'm gonna have to take her to the emergency room. But first, I'm gonna see if we can find the other piece of her ear. <sighs> God. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to end this video just a little bit short. We've got plenty of time to get Remy to the hospital in town. Luckily, there's an emergency vet clinic that we can go see. Let's go, Jane. Let's go, Nelly. Right here. Hey, I'm right here. <laughs> Come on, B. All right, we gotta take your sister to the hospital. <laughs> 